Hi everybody, Steph here and today what I thought I'd do is show you these two Schaefer pens. Now because it's coming, well it's rapidly approaching well the Christmas period I thought it'd be quite apt to show you these two pens. Now for you people that are in the know you'll notice that both of these pens are not in the original case. Um, these particular pens came in quite a large red box if you like but as you can see both of them are in Schaefer Schaefer boxes or cases or whatever so what we're going to do is let's take the pen out of the red case let's take the pen out of this case let's pop these to one side and what we have here is two as I say two Schaefer fountain pens now Schaefer brought out well, in 1996, they brought out these, what they termed as these holiday original pens. Now, they brought them out in the, at the Christmas period, but unfortunately, they only ran them for two seasons. So, i.e., they brought this one out in 1996, and this one underneath here in 1997. So, as I say, unfortunately, the... These particular pens, or this particular holiday original series, if you like, as I say, only lasted for two seasons. Now, let's pop the pen, this pen down there. Now, what we've got here, as I say, this particular one is what they term as the Holly pen. Now, well, first of all, you can see it comes in this red barrel. This particular pen is a, a Schaefer Imperial Triumph. That's the model. Um, as I say, it's the the Holly pen. And if we show you the the cap, there you can see why they call it the Holly pen. <laughs> okay. So as you can see, it's got these green Holly pens and well, presumably red berries along the along the cap there. If we bring it a little bit closer, I don't know if you can actually see. To the very top of the clip there, on one side, it has Schaefer, and if we turn it round, it may be upside down, but it actually says USA. So, this particular pen was made in USA. As I say, it's a Schaefer Imperial Triumph. Um, it's got the distinguished, or the very recognisable, white dot to the top of the cap there. Now, if we take the cap off like so, and show you the pen, and give it a couple of little twirls here. Let's pop the cap down there, and let's show you the nib. Okay, what you'll notice, you'll see that it's actually a inlaid nib, and if we bring it sort of as close as possible, and try and keep it in focus as well, what you'll notice to the nib, the imprint actually reads, um, Schaefer 23 carat gold electroplated. So this particular nib, the inlaid nib, is actually a gold electroplated nib. There you can see the feed, the feed underneath. And if we actually unscrew this particular pen, you'll notice that it's got the Schaefer converter inside the pen. Both of these pens are actually cartridge converter fountain pens, i.e. they can take the converter or they can also take a Schaefer cartridge. One thing I didn't um, sort of point out to you, there you can see on the cap there that this particular series, the first one, is dated 1996. So there we have it, this is the first one, the, Ho the Holly pen dated 1996 and it's a Schaefer Imperial Triumph fountain pen. So if we pop that down, so that was the first one, then the year after, Schaefer brought out this particular pen, and this is the Snow Pen. Now, the reason it's called the Snow Pen, again, if we keep it nice and still for you, and what I'll actually do is just rotate the barrel slightly. Just, there you go, I think it's my cold hands, a little bit of uh, mist on the, the barrel. So there we have you can see that it's got these snowflakes along the gold plated barrel. Again, if we show you a close up of the barrel, in this particular case, the date is on the top of the barrel, and as you can see there, this is 
the 1997 edition. If we show you the the cap band you'll see it says Schaefer and then if we turn it around slightly you'll see that it actually says USA. Slightly different from the other one this particular pen is a Schaefer Prelude fountain pen. Again slightly different you'll notice it's still got the the white dot to the top of the to the top of the clip there and if we turn it round you can see it's got this white inlaid jewel if you like to the top of the cap and all in all this particular cap is it's a sort of red burgundy and black marbled lacquer if you like and again if we keep it nice and still give you a little bit of a twirl as you can see a lovely lovely pen so <coughs> excuse me so as I say what we have this is the snow pen this is the 1997 pen and again it's a Schaefer Prelude that is the model of this particular pen if we take the cap off and give you a twirl on the pen pop the cap down and what we've got is a slightly different section if you like to this particular one you, you'll see there it's got two little gripping sections on each side and if we show you the nib on this particular one it's a two-tone nib and you can I don't know if you can actually see to the top of the nib there the top but top part of the nib near the tines is actually silver and the bottom bit where the Schaefer where it's got Schaefer written is in gold and the imprint on this one simply reads Schaefer so I'm assuming it's a gold plated a gold plated nib and again if we show you the feed underneath slightly different because this is a different model and let's just give you a sideways version there again a lovely little pen so all in all again what we have is the snow pen 1997 the date and as I said, this particular one is the Schaefer Prelude. Again, made in USA. So, there we have it. I'm not doing a writing sample. All I wanted to do is actually just show you the two pens. Because, in my opinion, as I say, they, they, they started it in 1996, which is this one. And then, the year after, they, they brought out this one in 1997. And then, for whatever reason, they actually stopped... Well, they stopped doing the what they termed as the holiday originals. So I would have thought that these are becoming quite quite rare by now, if they only made only made two two versions. So let's give you a little bit of a twirl. As I say, I'm not doing um, a writing sample. It's just simply to show you the two pens in comparison. So there we have it, the two Schaefer holiday originals. One being the Holly Pen and one being the Snow Pen. One dated 1996 and the other dated 1997. So I hope you've enjoyed looking at these pens as always. As much as I enjoy showing them to you. Don't forget I've got plenty more videos on my, on my channel. Go and have a look, leave a comment. But for now I'll just simply say bye bye now.